mice and mares, cubs and does, welcome to our show of shows. It is my great honour to introduce this evening's renowned guest, the one, the only, Mary Poppins! <laughs> One of the most intriguing things was the challenge of bringing back hand-drawn uh, animation when we've been out of it for so long professionally. I have never been a part of uh, anything really in hand-drawn, so it's been kind of a challenge, and that was a challenge I think I really wanted, um, is to learn from the old masters and kind of what has been done before, and how do we retrofit that into something more new and more current. Uh, so that was that was intriguing. I think that's when they ex explained kind of the sequence and although things have changed, it still s stayed the same. Um, and I think it's it was the challenge. I think that overall was intriguing. Come on up. Go. No, I haven't sung in years. No, I couldn't possibly. D flat major. First of all, animation is magic. It's the idea that um, an imagination can come to life. And the next step to that is now we've seen animation come to life, but can I now I can I now transport myself there and be there? Um, I don't think that's ever going to be an old idea. I think people are al always going to be interested in uh, can I escape this world and go into a world that's not that doesn't exist um, and not and more importantly can I go in this world that doesn't exist and feel like it's there that I'm there am I transported um, so I think the the short answer is magic I think that's what we want uh, and we want you to forget that it's not real I think we want you to believe that it, it, it exists and I think people want that Oh, freak out.